desperation is great motivation, like, because, you know, the early days our backs were against the wall, like, we're desperate to succeed. Um, like, as you know, the fear, fear of failure in Ireland is atrocious. My take on respect would be kind of anybody starting up to respect them and look after them, you know? And I suppose there's, there's a saying as well, a, a little knowledge is a dangerous thing, and I suppose we never confess to having that knowledge. Nobody wanted us in this game, so we had a lot of small battles along the way. But we dealt with as we went along, and now they have respect for us, and kind of up there with the as good as what's offered in Ireland at the moment, anyway. I suppose we don't say it um, about ourselves per se, but it has been said that West Cork Distillers is a distillery for the people by the people. people around us, that's the, the key to success, building a good team around you, you know. I agree with that, if you don't have good people around you, you, you won't go anywhere, because only so far you can go by yourself. West Cork is a place, you know, um, it's got huge heritage, and it's an area that was hit badly by, by the famine, but um, because of that there's a lot of West Cork people living in America, and when they see the West Cork brand they get excited by it too, I think. Getting text messages um, and pictures from people, and West Cork people that are travelling abroad, and um, they see it up in places and they're, they're so proud of seeing it that they send you texts and images and I think that's better than seeing it yourself. Company like this just could not come to the stage today if you were doing it on your own, if you were an individual, because if one fellow is down, two fellows are up. It's the fortunate thing about having three, that there'll always be a majority, you know. And so, you know, we, we do um, have differences of opinions, but two will always agree at one point. Like, uh, I suppose everybody's main goal is to get the new distillery finished at the moment. Yeah. And after that, it'll just move on to the next thing. There'll be more warehouses or off production. Bringing employment here, I suppose, is the highest accolade you can get, and, you know. So, yeah, if one of my sons, two sons, walked into business to be nice to leave a legacy after me, you know. So I suppose you wouldn't call it a stroke of luck. There's no such thing as look when it comes to work. You just kind of make your look, don't you?